So today I'm going to answer some of the questions I get in the comments. And one of them is, can you melt obsidian glass in the microwave kiln? Obsidian is volcanic glass, and it forms when lava cools down so quickly that crystals don't have time to grow, and it gives the rock a black, smooth, glossy shine. Now, there are other types of obsidian that have different colors. Another question I get all the time is, why don't you melt glass outdoors? That's dangerous. Well, as you can see, that's what I do. I melt all of my glass outdoors. And this is what the melted obsidian is looking like so far, but I think I'm going to have to put it in there for an additional five minutes. And after another five minutes, let's take it out and pop the lid off and see what this thing looks like. Looks pretty damn hot to me. And if you're wondering if I melt my uranium glass outside too, yes I do. And here's what it looks like. Really glossy and shiny. And when it's finished, it'll glow underneath a black light just like this. But let's get back to the melted obsidian and see how that turned out. My first thought is, it feels like a really hard piece of plastic. And it feels grainy. But I'm going to take my copper bopper and try to knock a chunk off of there and see if you could make an arrowhead out of it or not. But I don't think so. It looks real grainy. And for some reason, it feels much lighter than it did when I put it in there. So if you want to make an arrowhead from obsidian, do not melt it. 